welcome back. Today we're going to be turning this into a hydraulic handbrake. Why you might ask? I'm not really going to pay out for something that I can make myself. So let's get cracking. Right guys, what we've got is a clutch master cylinder off a Land Rover Defender. About £10 from your local motor factor. A couple of bits of pipe. And some box section. First thing we've got to do, just clean a few bits off. So what we're going to do with this piece is drop an M8 nut into the end, well ground it. We now have a captive nut that will thread straight on to the clutch master cylinder. Right, put that to one side to cool. And let's start on the framework. Basically with this bit, we're going to leave the top, top on, about an inch or so, leave the entire bottom on, and cut up here, across here, down the other side, so we have a nice framework for our hydraulic handbrake. basic shape for our frame. The next, the next bit we're going to do is cut out a few tabs that we can weld in here and here so we can mount our slave cylinder on the back. Unfortunately, that's where my camera died. So we went across to our backup, which is a really cheap GoPro copy, and it didn't record any audio at all, other than just noise from the grinder. So, plan B. You're just gonna have to bear with us. Watch the fabrication in super speed. And then check back with me in the end to see the finished product. Let's do that.
And there we have it. One hydraulic handbrake. Do apologise about the video. Lesson learned. Make sure I've got new batteries for every one I do. But I'm still learning. So we have, as we said at the beginning, Land Rover Defender Master Cylinder. Bit of box section. Couple of bits of pipe. All built for less than a tenner. If you like what you saw, if you want to carry on watching and keep up to date with us, like, comment, subscribe. I know it wasn't the best video in the world, but everyone starts somewhere. Have a good night.